Welcome here to Curvy Closet 2013. We're in our second year. We're excited. This is going to be a great show. Can't wait to interview everyone on our pink carpet. I am your Curvy correspondent, Aaliyah Slappy. Blah, blah, blah. Life is great. This is a great day, a great event, great beautiful models. It is going to be amazing, fantastic. Everything that you ever wanted. Honoring curves galore. What more could you ask for? the amazing Maddie from Plus Model Magazine, our title sponsor for today's event. Hello! Hi, how are you? I am great. How are you doing? Very well. So happy to be here. It's so great to have you. Let's just start by talking about this amazing outfit, the dress, the necklace. <laughs> Tell us about it. What are you wearing today? So, I'm wearing a Lane Bryant dress. All right. Um, a Lane Bryant little party. Um, I kind of kept it a little bit dressy but cash. Dressy um, cash, all right. And um, I love Lane Bryant. The jewelry is great. The dress is great. Yes. Okay. <laughs> excellent, excellent. So tell us a little bit about why an event like this is so important to you, so important to the magazine. Share a little bit about that with us. Um, I was here last year for the very first time for the first mm -hmm. one and yeah. I absolutely loved it. And I didn't wait for them to reach out to me. I reached out to Colleen and wow. myself. Wow. I just wow. felt like an event like this is something that promotes plus positive, you know, in the community. I think that women need to be here, not just aspiring models just women in general. We need to be around each other in an event that's absolutely positive and really celebrates plus size women and plus size fashion. Excellent. What is that one thing that you would want someone to know, someone who hasn't always celebrated her curves, hasn't honored her body, what's that piece of advice, that encouragement that you would want to share with her today? I think that she needs to take, number one, take it one day at a time and realize that we are all not, you know, plus positive all the time. There are days okay. where I can't find anything in my closet, you know, and I'm really upset and I'm like, what am I going to wear? Right, um, right. So I think it's really important to just really, you know, begin to love yourself and be good to yourself. If you treat your body really well, I feel like you will love yourself even more. And I think it's just a process. Start, don't think that what you see on Facebook and Instagram, that that's the way that it is all the time. Because right, it's not. Right. People put stuff out there, that's what people want to see. That's not the truth. Everybody goes through their struggles. Everybody yes. goes through it. So I think it's important to really know that we're all going through the same thing, that we all are trying to be positive every single day. Right. And be right. with like-minded people. Yes. Don't surround yourself yes. with negative yes. people. Don't yes. surround yourself with people that are always giving you self-worth based on what you look like or based on your weight. Be around plus positive people. That's a really, really good point. Excellent. Be around plus positive people. I absolutely love that. So with this being a fashion show, there are a lot of women who are aspiring models, plus size models. What is a bit of advice that you would give all of those women who are really looking to break into the industry? Right. Number one, read Plus Model Magazine. Read Plus Model <laughs> Magazine, step one, before you do anything else. Got it. Um, I have um, a 10-step step guide in the Plus Model Magazine blog. Okay. And um, I also have Modeling 101 segments ah. in each issue. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Um, and we have really great interviews with models that have been in the industry for a really long time. Right, and they right. give really those tidbits. Number one for me is knowing the research the the organization or you know the industry that you're trying to get into. Right. Maybe right, you right. don't meet the height requirement. Maybe you're not exactly the, the, the weight that they want. But right. maybe you can go into commercial modeling. Maybe right, you can go right, into right, parts right. modeling. There's so mm -hmm. many other things that you can do. Right. So don't kind of get down on the dumps if you're not exactly five eight or five nine. There are other ways. And maybe that's not what you're supposed to be because I thought I was gonna be Ashley Graham. Right, I'm right, good. right, right. But <laughs> you know what? I wasn't supposed to be Ashley. Mm -hmm. I was supposed to be me. So figure yes, out what yes. your journey is. Yes. That is the best piece of advice. And I think that's advice that translates from plus models to models at any stages to women in general. Absolutely. Like really embracing that, loving that, be who you're supposed to be, Absolutely. owning that. And I know that you are totally doing that. We are honored to have you here today. Thank you so much. You look amazing in all Lane Bryant. And so we want you just to enjoy the show. Thank you. Thank you so much for having me. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs> 